number eight, to explain what a redox reaction is and explain this type of reaction using the coenzyme um, NAD+. So, um, essentially, what we would need is figures 7.1 and figure 7.3. 7.1, you have the energy-rich molecule. The energy-rich molecule being the molecule that's um, being reduced or oxidized. While in 7.3, you have the conversion of NAD+. Um, to NADH being the reduction oxidation reactions, okay? So, um, essentially the way to remember it, or one of the ways to remember it is by using the term oil rig. With uh, oil, we have oxidation is loss of electrons, while reduction is gain of electrons, okay? So when we're performing an oxidation, we're losing electrons, when we're performing a reduction, it's gaining electrons should get that again out of your students. So um, you can point them directly first to figure 7.1 to explain the basic process of reduction, um, the uh, redu uh, reduction oxidation reactions, the redox reactions. Okay, and when you look at it, you see that um, uh, going to the right in the diagram, we see an oxidation occur. An oxidation is the loss of electrons. If you look at s figure 7.1, you see that you have the oxidation uh, occurring, the loss of the electrons um, uh, from the energy-rich molecules. So it's the energy-rich molecule that's losing the electrons, okay? Um, and what's gaining the electrons in this case is NAD+, okay? Um, as, uh, and make sure you're looking at figure 7.1. The other, uh, going back the other way, um, in figure 7.1, you have a reduction. Okay, with the reduction, you have a gain in the electrons. So what's gaining the electrons in, these, in this case is the, um, uh, the energy-rich molecule. Okay, that is what's gaining the electrons. And it's gaining these electrons from the NADH, okay, which you can see in figure 7.1. Now, specifically referring to figure 7.3, you change um, our, our tactic. Essentially, you're, um, instead of referring directly to the energy-rich molecule, you're referring directly to the conversion between NAD plus and NADH. NAD plus, uh, both uh, within the nicotinamide family of coenzymes, you have NAD plus conversion to NADH is a reduction. Okay, that reduction have a gain in the electrons um, going from NAD plus to NADH. That is a gain in electrons, okay? Uh, you can either think of it as gain in electrons or gain in hydrogens. Same general concept um, in essence. So here we have no H, there we have an H. The H is the one that's oxidized, sorry, reduced. The H is the one that is reduced, okay? This is reduced. That's the reduced form of the nicotinamide, the NADH. The oxidized form is the NAD plus oxidized. Okay, the oxidized form is the NAD plus. So um, going from NADH to NAD plus is an oxidation, which is the loss of electrons. You're losing electrons, you're losing that hydrogen going from NADH to NAD plus. Okay, so they should be able to see that um, in those two figures, okay? Again, it's, um, you're uh, getting the electrons from one molecule and adding it to another, so uh, the, these uh, oxidation and reduction reactions are always coupled together, thus the reason you call them redox reactions. They're, you always find them hand in hand, okay? Uh, and again, you wanna get all this from your students. You can even draw uh, figure 7.1 on the board yourself and have them explain to you step by step what's going on, okay, as a basic idea as how you approach this particular question. But again, you want to get as much from your students as possible, okay? And that is the, es the essence behind question number eight.